Assalamu alaikum ninjas, ahlan wa sahlan bikum, it's your tech ninja Muhammad. So here we go, Red Magic 5G, my battery kill test, Wi-Fi enabled, Bluetooth enabled, GPS enabled, also using the game mode, fan enabled ninjas, everything enabled, and also using the full turbo mode, the super performance, this is the highest that you can get and the highest maximum performance that you can push with the Red Magic 5G. So uh, we're gonna tap, uh, type in the time 638, 638, 18, 38 we have 100 percent of the battery we're gonna check here the temperatures also let's check here the temperatures 29 27 so under 30 celsius right now because i just unplugged it from the charger and it just and we're gonna see what's gonna happen obviously you can see by that i'm having also 144 hertz but also have that in mind that uh, i'm not fully uh, kind of using this 144 hertz with this with the game which is uh, which games are kept under 60 fps man it's fine even to have it under 60 fps but nevertheless uh, nevertheless, uh, also I'm gonna put the speakers, sorry for that, at 50%. Yeah, it got 50% like I do with all my smartphones. So Ninja, so we're gonna do until it dies, basically, until 0%. Uh, this is gonna be very interesting. I can't wait to see what will be the result. Uh, again, Ninja, so remember that, yes, maybe you're gonna say, this is maybe a little bit unfair, you are not, you enabled the fan, the fan will use more of the battery. Yes, yes, uh, they are completely right. That is not my point, Ninja. My point is to use everything that this smartphone has, Ninja, at the max. Maximum. That's why the, my battery kill test is called a killer drain test. We're gonna drain the battery uh, till zero to see uh, how this beast performs. Of course, Ninjas, you uh, check, can check. Uh, Technic done a really good uh, job regarding the battery comparison. Uh, he basically uh, went with the 60 hertz, and you can get around one and a half hour more screen on time with Red Magic 5G. But again, not in the gaming, just like an average moderate use, uh, like Facebook, a little bit of Facebook, a little bit of. Uh, uh, Chrome, a little bit of uh, Instagram, uh, you name it, and a little bit of the gaming. So Ninjas, uh, I think this is it, I get it, uh, for Red Magic 5G, this is uh, updated to the latest version, uh, it has 6.65 inch AMOLED panel, 144 Hz, uh, of course it has 4500 mAh battery, repolymer, and of course this is right now running Android 10 with the Red Magic uh, operating system, Android skin. Uh, we'll see, we'll see how this uh, this uh, battery will behave with the battery and drainage, will it have a linear discharging or something will have under 60% of the battery, maybe it's going to start to drain way, way faster. We'll see what's going to happen, we'll see what's going to happen. Like I said, I did note it here at the time, we started at 6.38pm, 100% battery oh it dropped already two percent Ooh, this is going to be very heavy like i said here this is going to be very very heavy test for the red magic 5g because i enabled everything that i could <laughs> oh i'm going to even enable the 4d shock why not only supports but supports only a few games this for 4d shocks so i can't even enable it yeah nothing is running in the background just to let you know nothing is running in the background what else i could do it is to even make a more crazy test it is enable the screen recorder but i'm not going to use that ninjas that's going to be too much much now i'm gonna just leave it as it is uh, like every uh, user gaming user will just game and most of you want to screen record only youtubers are using the screen recorder yeah anyway stay tuned see you in one hour you can just in half minute it's gonna be one hour since uh, we started playing arc survival on red magic 5g man not a single fps <laughs> drop basically the game doesn't lag whatsoever also the temperatures are really cool they are really really cool the, it's just a little bit kind of uh, temperature body uh, if i a little bit higher than the uh, temperature of my body how what's my temperature of my body man 35 yeah a little bit higher a bit a little bit higher than my temperature 35 celsius i'm having 34 up there anyway uh, let's check here out of uh, Arc Survival Evolved. Ninjas, remember, we're still running uh, with the uh, 144 Hz fan enabled, completely fan, but it didn't stop at all, Ninjas. It didn't stop at all. And by the way, uh, I don't know, uh, basically, this fan technology, the cooling system, I don't know how, how durable it is. And how are we going to even fix it if it breaks or something like that? I mean, this is really, probably they made it really good. The smartphone, it is expensive. Don't think that this is a cheap product. No, it's not. 100, there it goes. 73% in just 73%. Wow, bro. Wow. I don't remember the last the smartphone took this 27% 27, 27 of the battery in just 27% of the battery this beast took. 27%. 
for one hour. 27% for one hour. Oh my god, that is that's a lot. That is a lot. That have to admit that is a lot for one hour. That is a lot. One hour. So now we're gonna go to next. Uh, next, basically, uh, let me just put here 17, 19, 38. Now we're gonna go to 20, 38, and then we're gonna have 21, 38, inshallah. You're gonna see the battery percentage. So you can see by something just the first hour took 27%. This is by far, so far, uh, with these uh, flagship smartphones with the Snapdragon 865, uh, the biggest drainage that I had with the flagship smartphone. I knew it, I knew it, Ninja. I didn't expect to have that this smartphone will have a better battery life than, example, OnePlus 8 Pro or Samsung S20 Ultra. No, I didn't expect that, Ninjas, because it has a fan enabled, it has 144 hertz screen and everything. And maybe, maybe by the end of this video, I'm gonna do part two. Maybe I'm gonna include it in the same in the same video. Maybe I'm gonna do also maybe one or, or two hours playing this game without the fan on and on 60 hertz refresh rate. I'm gonna also do that, but I will have the screen brightness at maximum Wi-Fi and GPS enabled okay I will do that also for you so please stick around and you're gonna see what's gonna happen temperatures I think we checked it did I show you even the temperatures subhanallah no I didn't show you the temperatures 38 Celsius 38.1 let's check here more 38.3 the first hour of gaming 38.3 Ninjas, I'm gonna make a special uh, compilation video on my YouTube channel where I'm gonna put do comparisons and show you the results of uh, the top five uh, flagship smartphones that I tested so far, the battery drain till uh, kill test. So for, so far, I'm seeing here 38.3 is the highest temperature for the Red Magic 5G after one hour of gaming. Anyway, stay tuned and see you in one hour. Again, that will be two hours of total gaming. Okay, uh, we are back in just another hour, just uh, makes it two hours in total for the Arc Survival Evolved with the Red Magic 5G. Remember the fan is still enabled, 144 Hz out uh, back at maximum brightness, using the GPU performance up, boost up, everything is maxed. Temperatures right now, we dropped from 38.3 to 37.5. 37.5. Here, the second hour, in just. Yeah, 37.5. Perfect. Anyway, let's check this out, the timing. So it's 45, 45%, 45 ninja. So that's basically, let's see here, how much is that? Uh, 28, so 28% of the battery, bro. Wow, 28% of the battery, 28 ninjas. 1% more from the first hour, the second hour took 28% of the battery. Uh, oh my god, this is really crazy. Uh, really heavy, heavy. This fan and this 144 Hz drains the battery really fast, especially here right now. What is that? The flies. I don't know, fly just passed. Anyway, just. We're gonna play Arc Survival again for one more hour to see what we're gonna have. Now we have 45% of the battery. It dropped to 44 now, but nevertheless, it was 45, and we're gonna play, play now to 8.38, now it's uh, 8.39. Performance-wise, really good. Temperatures are also really good, 37.5, that's really great temperatures after two hours of gaming, you have to admit. Beautiful. Anyway, see you in one hour. Can you just, we are back, Red Magic 5G. Also because uh, I can... Wait a minute, what did I want to say, bro? Uh, anyway, let's check here the temperature. I think it's the timing. It's... it's wait a minute, what is that? 36.9. Is that 30... I saw, I thought I saw 37. So I'm gonna leave it. I saw 37 there. 37... Okay, it's 36.9. I saw 37. I'm gonna just remember 37. I hope I can catch that. But it's showing me now 36.8. There they go, there they go. Come on, give me 37, bro. Can you give me 37 here? Okay, it does want to give me 37. 36.9. Anyway, 17% of the battery in just 17% of the battery. So that's basically 28. 
28 uh, again same battery drainage as for the second hour the third hour is 28 percent in just you can see by stuff in just remember fan is activated 144 hertz brightness is a maximum game enhancement also everything is maxed at uh, basically the super performance mode you can see by stuff so yes uh, the CPU to the maximum, GPU to the maximum, woohoo! And of course, like I mentioned before, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, and screen brightness at maximum. You get the point, yeah? The performance-wise, so far we have three hours and we left 16, 17, 16%. We're gonna see how much we should get. Probably gonna get around, I don't know, my predictions, maybe, maybe 40, 40 minutes, maybe 40 minutes. This is my prediction that we're gonna get 40 minutes with the Red Magic 5G with these rest of the 17, 16 minutes. But we'll see what's gonna happen. We'll see what's gonna happen in just. Anyway, the performance is really crazy smooth. What a great uh, gaming device. Uh, uh, if you check my speed test, you will know that the Red Magic 5G is officially the fastest smartphone on my uh, channel and basically in the whole world, at least most of the reviewers said that. Uh, probably they also have the, the same experience, but nevertheless, with my own uh, real raw hardcore speed test videos, uh, Red Magic 5G even won against the OnePlus 8, OnePlus 8 Pro, and Samsung S20 and Huawei P40 Pro. So it beat the Kirin 990, it beat the Samsung Snapdragon version, and the OnePlus 8 Snapdragon A65. It's it was way ahead of the Black Shark 3, just Black Shark 3, just not on pair with the Red Magic 5G in the CPU raw power. SOC regarding the everyday apps. Gaming, they are very similar, you can check that on my YouTube channel. Like 5% up, 5% down, not a big difference in the game in just. Anyway, stay tuned and see you in, I don't know, 40 minutes, something like that. Okay, so uh, Ninjas, uh, I will just show you right now again temperatures. So the, we're going into the hour of three and a half hours. Three and a half hours with the Red Magic 5G temperatures are right now, they dropped under 36 Celsius, Ninjas, under 36 Celsius, this is really good, and right now, this is exactly right now, half hour, and how much of the battery left, 2% Ninjas, so I was close, I was not correct, I saw that I'm gonna get 40 minutes more, but for now, we have, for now, until now we have three hours and 30 minutes, three hours and a half uh, hours, uh, three hours and a half, three and a half hours. Maybe this 2% will give us maybe, two, I don't know, maybe three, four minutes more. I don't know, we will see what's gonna happen. Just uh, uh, measure, uh, of course, uh, check this timing, of course, the same Red Magic and Pokemon F1 is by the way on the background, it's on the background. Then, uh, basically, performance-wise here, uh, I can feel that right now the CPU is trying to shut down. You can see by myself that the Red Magic 5G is right now lagging. This really uh, uh, usual with the different smartphones, but the, I can feel that this, uh, the game right now is not the same as. Oh, oh, oh! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! The fan is still working, and I don't even know how this smartphone will shut down. Will it shut down first the fan, or so it's going to completely shut down itself? Okay, now it seems that it's better. I don't know what was that, but now it's some, somehow it's like yeah, it is better. It is better. But I can feel that it's laggy. It is laggy then just probably because right now it's going into the 1% and the processor probably knows this and just wants to save on the battery maybe. I don't know, maybe it has some kind of intelligence thing. I basically, I didn't include, I didn't turn anything in the battery performance mode in just. And which is really interesting with the Red Magic 5G, you don't even have a lot of options in the battery. You can't even check any huge statistics or something like that, uh, in-depth statistics. We'll see if I uh, manage to show you that on the end. I'm gonna try to. There you go. I can see that it's lagging right now. Probably the chipset, the processor is shutting down the performance. I still. The battery is low and will power off. You see? I knew it. Yeah, yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Something is happening. Still enhancements, still 140, fan is enabled, everything is enabled. And just screen brightness at maximum. 1% of the battery. We are into the two minutes now. We'll see what's gonna happen. So we'll just be playing and we'll probably in just we're gonna get 3 hours and 33 minutes or so, 2 minutes past. So Red Magic 5G Ninjas uh, in my channel, in my hands, is the fastest smartphone that I tested ever in my life. Uh, it has really amazing panel, it's so fluid, 144 hertz is it's a really an amazing, amazing feature to have with your smartphone. Uh, make sure to check my uh, videos, speed test comparisons, gaming comparisons with different smartphones. I'm going to also do a comparison between 144 hertz, 90 hertz and 60 hertz. 
now this I can feel I can feel that the the, the, the this the processor is just struggling right now because the battery is trying to shut down there you go there you go you can probably see it we're there three minutes three hours and 33 minutes we're gonna see what's gonna happen 4500 image battery it has a 55 volts charger and in just 40 minutes to fully charge it 40 minutes four zero that's really really fast uh, for this uh, again not the fastest in the world Realme X2 Pro uh, has the fastest it's 29 minutes I think so like that <laughs> crazy crazy battery the Realme X2 Pro I have to admit Oh man, oh, I'm gonna even get maybe in the in the th fourth minute, maybe three hours and 34 minutes. Maybe it's gonna be like that. So Ninja, what I love about the Red Magic, uh, Red Magic 5G, it has amazing speakers. They are very, very loud. I love the triggers also. It has triggers on the top for the PUBG and other games, like Call of Duty, etc, etc. You can adjust here the uh, triggers, the like shooting and aiming. Uh, the aim. Oh my god, it's amazing. That's an amazing four minutes four minutes right now three hours and 34 minutes Let's see here. Come on and uh, I feel like it's shutting down. You can probably feel here. That is super super sla laggish right now Which really interesting with the oneplus 8 pro oxygen OS doesn't do something like this It doesn't uh, it doesn't weaken the the processor won't weaken the performance and boom There you go. Halas three hours and 34 minutes ninjas Three hours and 34 minutes for the Red Magic 5G. Everything is maxed. Maxed. Everything is maxed. Maxed. This is the time. Three hours and 34 minutes. Ninjas, th remember this is... Uh, I'm probably going to check that on my YouTube channel. But this is right now uh, the worst result that I got with the flagship smartphone. Uh, with Snapdragon A65. Uh, most of the smartphones got above four hours. This one gets three hours and 34 minutes. But yet again, this is my first smartphone with 144 hertzes. I did test the Samsung S20 with the 120 hertz panel. And this device has an actual fan, a physical fan for the cooling. You saw the temperatures, great, great temperatures on the end, the fourth hour. Uh, no, the three, in the third hour to the fourth hour, it was like under 36 Celsius. That's a really great, great temperatures. Let me just uh, wipe it a little bit. It's, yeah, there you go, perfect. Anyway, just I hope you enjoyed in this battery kill test uh, Red Magic 5G. You're gonna have the buying links in the description. An impressive, impressive battery, just really, really impressive. I will maybe try to add in this video uh, maybe one or two hours of battery test without using a fan, without using 144 hertz, it's just a standard 60 hertz. Uh, uh, mode enabled with Wi-Fi, GPS, Bluetooth, and maximum brightness. We'll see what's gonna happen, how much it will drain uh, battery in one hour. But again, the battery drainage is linear. It's very linear, Ninjas. It's not like one first hour was 27% and the second hour was 35%. It was very, very similar like you see by itself. My salam and see you till next time. Okay, Ninjas, so we're gonna do right now 60 hertz without the game turbo mode, without, without the fan, Ninjas, without the extreme performance, with private, Bluetooth, uh, Wi Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, uh, screen brightness at maximum, Arc Survival Evolved for one or two hours, and we're gonna see the timing is 1 20, Ninjas, 1 20 a.m. I know I'm a really uh, crazy guy, Ninjas, work at doing the, all these uh, tests so late. Uh, but uh, love it, love it, Ninjas. Uh, anyway, I did woke up today a little bit uh, later, a bit late, so that's why I'm doing this uh, test right now. Red Magic 5G. Also, we're gonna have, yeah, speakers are already there. Perfect. AM 100%. And check here the temperatures. 29. I just unplugged it, Ninjas. It's 100% fully charged. I just unplugged it. So stay tuned in just we're gonna see each other's after one hour or maybe two hours we will see depends we're gonna see what is happening with the red magic 5g i didn't enable the game turbo mode or anything in just the fan made is not working the fan is not working so we're gonna see how this device the behaves without the fan activation because the fan does use more power uh, and obviously it uses uh, the battery consumption it is higher faster stay tuned can you just quickly here to show you after one hour 22 percent in just 22 percent for one hour on this setup check it out five percent less than just five percent less just not using the game mode and not using the fan bro that is crazy that is crazy and now we're gonna go to 2 20 uh, basically 3 20 a.m now it's 2 20 a.m but we're gonna go to uh so 2 20 a.m and uh, now we have what about 78 percent now we're gonna go to another hour to see how much we're gonna have okay stay tuned temperatures let's check here 35 less than 56 
Not bad, bro. Not bad. You, you can compare by yourself the first hour with the fan enabled 36.1. Right now with the Ark Survival Evolved. By the way, the Ark Survival Evolved is not that the most uh, overheating game in the world. Shadow Gun Legends on Ultra Max. It is one of the uh, smartphones which he's the most. Shadow Gun Legends. We'll have the separate video for that one, just Anyway, see you in one hour. Remember, screen brightness, maximum, Wi-Fi, GPS, and yeah, there you go. Okay, and just here we go. Another hour passed uh, with the uh, Red Magic 5G. 56%. Now we have 56%. The second hour. So that is basically what is that? Let's see here. Uh, oh my God! What? Oh my God! Wait a minute. Is that no? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That should be. Oh yeah. Is it? Yeah, fast. No. Wait, wait. Wait. Let me see how much is that. I need to calculate. By the way, it's fifty-six percent. Let me just check the temperatures, and I'm gonna tell you exactly how much it's take. So what we have here, thirty-seven point, which is really interesting. In just this is very very interesting. I uh, saw so thirty-seven point three. Then uh, okay, thirty-seven point three is the maximum temperature that we have right now in the second hour of the game with the Red Magic. 5G. This is really interesting that the heating itself with this game, uh, even without the fan actually enabled, I don't know, can we even say that the fan even helped that much at all? The performance is the same, it just no lag here at all. It's running the same as the from the minute one. Super buttery smooth. You can see myself how fast and smooth this is. And by the way, just uh, I don't see any difference whatsoever playing this game on 144 Hz or on 60 Hz. And you shouldn't because this game it is capped and you know, it can't run more than, I think it's running uh, 30 FPS I think so that game. Or it's capped at 60 FPS, I'm not sure. I think it's capped at 30 FPS this game. Uh, anyway, let me just calculate. Okay, so Ninjas is the same percentage, subhanAllah, it's the same percentage, uh, it took 22%, so from 78 to 56, it took the same percentage uh, per one, the first hour and the second hour. This linear, uh, it has linear, really, really great linear discharging, maybe gonna have an, uh, a percent up uh, or percent down, but it's a really great linear discharging with the red Magic 5G, and Ninjas, by this calculation, you should get easily, easily uh, at least one hour more, at least one hour more with this. Uh, with this setup at 60 hertz you're not gonna have like three and a half hours you're gonna have four and a half hours which the rest of the smartphones even give me the same result ninja similar result okay not the same exactly same result but you can check that obviously i'm gonna probably include this video in my compilation video regarding the battery uh, drainage con consumption but i can tell you i can tell you uh, right now at 60 hertz this beast will give you a similar similar result as the other flagship smartphones on the market running on 60 hertz panel uh, this game some some of them uh, can, will give you like better because i do agree i do agree that uh, uh, oxygenos and MIUI still have one of the best battery uh, optimized android skins because they don't have, for example, Oxygen OS it doesn't have many apps running in the background, etc, etc. And it's not that bombarded with the apps. It's really, really clean cut software. And we just, I think this is it. Like I said, I repeat again, the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, and screen brightness at maximum with Red Magic 5G. We just didn't enable the game Turbo. I didn't have the game, game Turbo on. We didn't have the fan. So yes, you probably know that. And obviously, we were running this one on 60 Hz. You can see myself here on the top left corner. This was running on 60 Hz. See myself, 60 Hz is there. Yeah, you can see that. I hope you can see that. Yeah, 60 Hz. Anyway, enjoy and have a great day. The battery is amazing. The battery is amazing. If you don't use the game turbo mode and without the fan, you can have a really great uh, gaming experience with this beast in jazz. 4,500 image battery plus. Even if you really uh, use it in a, in a heavy, heavy uh, way, you can charge it really fast from 0 to 100%. That's in 40 minutes only. That's really, really fast. Anyway, have a great day and see you the next time. Again, touch a check and hear the temperatures 37.3 again. So, Ninjas, this is very, very interesting. Uh, the temperatures are exactly the same with the fan or without it. Similar, similar symptoms, if not exactly the same temperatures.